yesterday so if I'm looking like really orange then that's why or if I'm looking really tanned I've gone onto her Instagram and found a couple of photos that I think I might do like this one is like if you can't see it I'll put it on the screen but like this one here is the one that I sort of already have on um, I'm kind of keeping it more like PG than this one but I'm gonna keep like the makeup all the same so yeah, I'm going to start with the makeup first and I've looked up a couple images. I was just going to start with the makeup. Put this like headband thing on and it's going to look weird but like, and it's just going to look bad. It's not going to look weird. I hate that word weird. <laughs> that looks great. No, I can't do it. Change to this headband instead. I've got this song stuck in my head called 100 Bad Days. I'm going to start off with some moisturiser. This is so unhygienic, but whatever. I just use my hands to rub that in. A hundred bad days is a hundred good stories. A hundred good stories makes me interested in parties. Okay, so I've totally lost my eyebrow brush. Uh, uh, my eye brow brush. So I'm gonna have to use this fat brush to fill in my eyebrows and then like carve it out. And this Maybelline Angel Wine concealer to carve them out. I'm not a big eyebrow person and I got them like waxed for the first time yesterday ever. Also this might sound weird but I kind of liked getting my eyebrows waxed. I don't know if it's just the excitement because I've never got it done before. No, I ain't scared of you. A hundred bad days is a hundred good. I'm also gonna put some of that concealer on my eyelid before I do the eyeshadow. Time to start the eyeshadow. Now, before I do that, I'm actually just gonna set the concealer. And I know people like don't do this anymore, but like I like it if I'm doing a softer look. And not as wham bam in your face. What arms of bam? Wham bam in your face. Pam. Like, okay, this is a thing. Like, I look at other YouTube channels and some of them are like really out there and crazy, and then others are like so mild and stuff. And then I'm like, I have days where I'm like people that are like wild and crazy and really out there, and then days where I'm like being a very mild, you know, chill. And, like, I'm just gonna put this in my crease kind of YouTube. I don't really know what I'm doing. I know you're supposed to like brand yourself and stuff, but I'm just being me. I'm just doing whatever I feel like. Like this channel's literally me doing things that I want to do. I'm mixing these two colors together and I'm just gonna pop that in my crease. Alrighty, so it's been like a while since the last clip, but um. It's now nearly dark outside and it's been like a couple hours and I've done this eye how I like it, how I would like it to turn out. So yeah, I'm now going to show you how to do it on this eye. So what I did was take this brush here and then I dipped into this one here. And then I put this on the outer V and in the crease as well. Okay, then I took this like flat smudger brush and that tapped into this gold shade like very lightly and then like lightly put a bit of sparkle on the lid. I love bronzy looks. Now I'm going to do a winged eyeliner. 
wish me luck. Actually, while I was doing my makeup, I was watching um, Logan Paul's podcast, Impulsive. I actually really like it. It's very interesting to see different creators views of different things and mistakes they've made along in their career path and I also like like watching things that are about other people to see like the mistakes they've made and kind of like learn from that oh and that's also why I've been watching the um team 10 uncut to see how this new Team 10 goes because you know the last one was a bit of a disaster and I just want to see how um, Jake runs Team 10 because I'm very interested in the business side and how he does that love to like have my own like makeup brand like yeah like actual like making makeup and stuff but I've also wanted to have like my own business where I just do like treatments also have this recent idea of maybe doing a making my own like mini tv show kind of series thing on youtube now i'm going to be taking this um black eyeshadow and like a little pencil brush and be basically putting this over the top of the wing now i'm just going to take this like smudging brush that we use for the sparkle and smudge the black eyeshadow eyeshadow now i'm going to just be doing it some mascara and some individual eyelashes okay so i've finished my eyes and i'm now going to put my face makeup on oh i really should have my hairband got my hairband on okay i'm gonna apply a bb cream because i use bb creams instead of foundations well i just like like trying out different things so yeah I'm using this Garnier BB cream. I use it with a sponge because I feel like it works better. Family's watching a movie at the moment, so if you hear like things in the background, that's probably it. Actually, this is a good time to film because there's no like cars until like later, and there's like coons like a <laughs> the worst sound of a car ever. What the um, you know. Tones and I song stuck in my head, the not Johnny Runaway, the Dance Monkey. Is that what it's called? Dance Monkey or something? Stuck in my head. Dance or dance when hands from me were on. Yeah, hey, I'm looking now. I'm surrounded by your embrace. Some of the Maybelline. Rewind on under my eyes. Da -dum -dum -dum. Da -dum -dum -dum. This one is my one. I don't look like having. I don't like. I don't like looking like I have a moustache. If you could ever understand what I am saying. Okay, now I'm gonna powder my under eyes. I just put that where I put the concealer, and I feel like I always like lean back when I'm like doing my makeup, you know, like that. I feel like my day's only just started, and it's like six o'clock. Time for some bronzing. Body shot. Honey bronzer. Okay, now to like contour, I'm gonna use the same bronzer, but like with a like slim brush like this. And then I'm going to like really. I really want to do more creative makeup on this channel too. I want to get more friends involved. So if you're watching this, guys, let me know if you want to. Okay, now I'm going to be putting on a little bit of blush. There you go, Billy. You can use that in your next song. Just a little of colour. Okay. Highlight and then lips and I'm done. Okay, for highlight, oh, I'm going to be using the e.l.f. Pink Test. Baked 
the wash. Holy cow! I feel like this. <coughs> oh. Okay, highlighting, that's what I'm doing. Ariana's. I feel like I can't say her name properly. Ariana. Ariana Grande. Ariana Grande. Ariana. Her highlights always like pop in and please be quiet. And metallic. Why mine's gonna be like bam. Whoa. I'm now going to take this lipstick here and I'm literally going to put this on with my finger. This is what I do if I'm going to wear lipstick like any time. I sing you, sing you, sing you every time. But let's go take some photos with the, my hair down first and then we can do the ponytail one. And then I'll show you the result. Let's Go, girls! Okay, so I took some photos of my hair down and I need to close the door! Okay, so I've done some um, photos of my hair down and now I'm going to do some with the classic ponytail. Quite a big chunk, probably like that much. Okay, so I'm going to keep that separate. And then tuck that behind my ear. Okay. First things first is I'm going to do the low ponytail. Because this is supposed to make my hair look longer. So I'm going to like halve it. Sort of. Now I'm just going to get a headband and like tie this bit up. Out of the way. So I'm going to do a low ponytail. Ponytail, whatever you call it. Okay, then I'm gonna take this out. Ow! And then, oh no, I've lost my little piece. Okay, so right now I'm just doing a super duper tall ponytail. I've got this clip here and I'm gonna put that at the back since no one's gonna see it. And I'm gonna keep adding hairbands. Just to make it even taller. Ow, this really hurts. I don't even know how she does this. I'm gonna leave the bottom half out. Because you're not gonna see the back. And that way, when I do this, it should look better. Yeah. I'm then going to be adding hair around the band. The hair, and this is pretty much the finished look how do i look okay now i'm going to take some more photos and i'll be back to show you how i edit them okay so it's now the next day and i've just spent i don't even know how many hours editing these but just keep in mind when i show you these photos i'm not very good at editing and i only edited on facetune and yeah Oh my god, one of these photos looks like like a school photo, but like a weird school photo. <laughs> this is the this is one of the photos and <laughs> yes, my photo ended up looking like a weird school photo for this photo. This is my photo. One and this one I'm like alright with, like it could have been worse. But it still doesn't look like hers. I think that's it. Yeah. The photos, and now I'm going to just be putting them on the gram. Okay, I'm gonna go with that. I kind of like it, it's kind of cool. I don't know. I don't know when it switched off, but I got a comment on my first photo, and it's from my friend. And we also posted the other photo here. 
this is what it looks like and this is the caption if we give a little love maybe we could change the world and then that's it so I think this is pretty much the hold on let me move back to the middle so this is the end of the video I hope you guys really enjoyed this video and I think I put a lot more effort into it than I usually would like I did like like <laughs> like 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 um like I did the screen recording and the editing recording and recording me taking the photos and like the cool little intro and stuff and usually I would have just done like the makeup and then shown the pictures but I decided that I'm gonna try and put more effort into these and I hope you guys in Enjoy the videos and yeah don't forget to go check out the photos and like them on my Instagram and I'll see you guys next time bye